welcome to IT in Canada. This is a special live edition from uh, the Uptime Institute Symposium here in California. I'm joined by Liam Bedford, who, like us, is a German guy from uh, Canada. You're based in Edmonton. Yeah, right? Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. Now, the buzz around Uptime this year is all around evaporative cooling, and Silent Air is an evaporative cooling vendor. I was hoping maybe you could walk us through what it is that you folks do here to help evaporative cooling to reduce the power use in the data center and to make it more efficient, more cost effective, and more environmentally friendly. Sure, sure, sure. What we have here is a computer room error handling unit, otherwise known as a crack to some people, terminology of data centers. Uh, it's actually using uh, pure 100% evaporative, direct evaporative media. Um, it's, using, it's a high static application, it handles up to three inches external static. We use direct drive plenum fans. We introduce outside air through the EVAP. We get typically 30 degrees delta T through the EVAP and back out to whole aisle. Um, it's, it's made for higher humidity climates. Uh, the air enters through the top of the unit. It passes through these filters to remove particulates and then hits this beating, which is kind of like Cardboard. Yeah, yeah, it's craft paper. Yeah. And then this is this is coated with water to remove heat from your hopefully low humidity air. Because if it comes in if the air comes in hot and wet, there's not much you can do for it. But if it, how hot can the air be coming in in order to exit at an appropriate temperature? Yeah, we're not worried about hot air, we're worried about humid air. So that's the white ball we are targeting. So you could deploy a unit like this even in a place like Phoenix where you're using really hot air. Yeah. yeah. Florida, need a little bit of <laughs> chilled water, knock down cooling or some type. And another feature of this system, if I understand it right, is that you're capable of just taking outside cold air if the temperature is below the set point on the environment. Yeah, correct. correct. We don't run water over the media, we just introduce 100% outside air. Through the fan, we have fans running, so it's not exactly free cooling. You have fan, fan motor horsepower, but that's all we're running as far as. But still, relative to the cost of running a chiller 24 7, 365, this must be hugely efficient. Yeah, no mechanical cooling in this. Uh, typically, some of our builds in some of the better climates are in the 1.08 PUE range, so it's a chillerless solution for that. Which is why it's the buzz here in the Uptime Institute Symposium. Yeah. Liam, thank you so thank much. You. Good luck to Silent Air yeah, up in Edmonton. Thank you. Thank you.